Supta Bada Konasana, the recline bound angle posture. It's one of the classic restorative posture. The level of this asana is for beginners, intermediate and advanced and the type of this posture is restorative and hip opener. The muscles engaged by this posture is the adductors or the inner thigh muscles. Now let us see the chakras activated by this asana. You have Muladhara, the root chakra and Agnya, the third eye. The physical benefits of this asana is it strengthens the inner thigh muscles, groin and the knees. It helps to improve the health of kidneys, bladder, ovaries, prostate glands and uterus. It also soothes menstrual and menopause discomfort and also good for pregnant women in preparation for childbirth. Mental benefits of this asana is when your agnya is activated, it gives you more awareness, memory and willpower. Your mind becomes steady, calm, reliable and free of all attachments. And when your muladhara is activated, it makes you feel more energetic, secure and you have a healthy eating habit. And also you feel more grounded and stable. But you need to follow a precaution before doing this asana. People with knee or groin injury make sure to perform this asana only with blankets under the outer thigh of both the legs and for people whose knees are not touching the ground it's okay but make sure not to push your knees down with your hands for your knees to touch the ground as it might hurt your knees now lie down flat on the ground and from here gently bend your knees your feet flat on the ground and once you're ready stretch your knees out sideways and your feet together relax your spine completely on the ground just feel the intense stretch in your hips feel your knees stretching out keep breathing and slowly from here bring your knees back to center and stretch your legs out for Shavasana